Uh, there has been a trend in global construction, especially for uh, skyscrapers. There have been a lot of new super tall buildings that rather than using the traditional steel frame structure that was used for about 100 years of the first generations of skyscrapers around the world. Uh, instead, they're switching back to wooden construction. And this isn't traditional uh, two by fours, the way we've been using in small uh, light frame timber construction for houses. These are highly treated, pressed and glued uh, se segments that form larger pieces. And it's those that you use almost like steel beams in these new types of, sh of uh, buildings. And that's really exciting because when you're you, when you're doing pressed treated wood, the source material doesn't have to be old growth trees. You can actually combine this with sustainable forestry practices like coppicing. Sorry, segue. Uh, coppicing, guys, is when you let small branches of trees grow from a uh, established base and then cut them off every few years to get a lot of regular, straight, thin, short pieces of wood that you can then use for a variety of construction purposes. It used to be a part of forest management for everybody for thousands of years, and now it's no longer uh, really practiced as much. But my point is you can combine sustainable uh, land management practices with these newer styles of construction using these materials and end up having less carbon, less degradation of the ecosystem, less land use change, which is another big factor for CO2 emissions, and still end up with a beautiful, imposing, fairly cheap to build structure.